Today we're going to be looking at this Apesa RAM. It's DDR5, they're calling it Panther. It's also RGB on top. There's various speeds available and sizes, but the ones we're looking at are the 32 gig kit at 6,000 megahertz. Before we get on with the review, let us know what RAM you're using. Are you using DDR5 yet, or are you still using DDR4 or even DDR3? Let us know. And also, do you actually see much of a difference depending on the speeds? Because some people say, yeah, there's a huge difference, and then others say there is absolutely not. So let us know in the comments. Today we're looking at a Pacer Panther RGB DDR5, a high-performance gaming memory module. Available in sizes from 16 to 32 gigabytes in single and twin packs with speeds from 5200 megahertz all the way up to 6400 megahertz. It's designed for both gamers and PC enthusiasts. This module stands out with a seven color RGB lighting strip and is compatible with various motherboard lighting software. Depending on the version you get, it operates at voltages between 1.25 volts and 1.35 and features cast latencies of 40, 40, 40, then 80 or 84 or 86, depending again on the version. It's also equipped with Intel's XMP 3.0 and AMD's Expo certification for hassle-free overclocking. The packaging catches your eye with its glossy black box adorned with cutouts to showcase the RAM. A unique scratch mark design mimics an RGB Panther clawing at the box. The box, which is standard for the Panther DDR5 RGB range, includes a sticker indicating RAM amounts and speeds. While cast ratios aren't mentioned on the box, they can be spotted through the window printed in small text on the RAM itself. The back of the box offers other basic information in multiple languages. Inside the box you'll find the RAM neatly packaged in a plastic blister pack. That's it, simple and straightforward with no manuals or unnecessary extras. The RAM's design is sleek, featuring a silver and black heatsink with a panther head and scratch-like effects. The top of the RAM boasts a diffused RGB strip that smoothly extends over the edges of the RAM, enhancing its visual appeal. The black PCB blends seamlessly with the aluminium heatsink. The RGB lighting is impressive, with its well diffused top and even spread. Depending on the lighting in the room or your PC case, the placement of individual LEDs can be noticeable with some sections appearing brighter. The lighting effect is customizable though with your chosen software. We tested the RAM on both a Z760 and a Z790 motherboard. With no issues in recognising the XMP profile, it is also AMD Expo certified, so you shouldn't have any issues regarding the overclocking performance. Just remember though, DDR5's default rate speed is 4800 MHz. Anything faster is factory overclocked, so always check your motherboard can handle these higher speeds. In our 48 hour stress test using Eurosoft's PC check, the RAM performed flawlessly in and outside a Windows environment with no failures or crashes. In our 6000 MHz kit, we managed to reach speeds of 6400 MHz with some adjustments, although results can vary based on your motherboard and other factors. Temperature wise, it peaked at around 31 degrees Celsius internally and 25 degrees Celsius externally on the heatsink in a well ventilated system with a room temperature of 21.5 degrees Celsius. Overclocking will increase those temperatures. The Apesa Panther RGB DDR5 is a blend of style and high performance, making it a superb choice for upgrading your gaming rig.
I hope you enjoyed this video and know I did. Why not check out one of our other videos by clicking this box up here or this one just down here. Otherwise, you can give us a thumbs up, like, subscribe, comment below, let us know what you think, and we'll see you next time.